Hi, it's Fred, CEO of the Network for Global Innovation, and welcome to another Fred Talk. Today, we're going to talk about one of the key components of the engine innovation ecosystem, and that key component is policy and political leadership. I believe it all starts at the top, that it's the leader that sets the direction for the city, region, state. It is the, re the leader that walks the walk in addition to just talk the talk. That's so critical because cities need to start acting more like startups. They need to be quicker. They need to invent more. They need to be innovative. So leadership sets that tone. I have two great examples of that in real world, both of which were uh, I had the pleasure of working with in Los Angeles. So the first one, Mayor Antonio Villaraigosa. I think Mayor Villaraigosa was way ahead of his time. He saw the future of LA as building a huge green economy. And he, re he realized that to build a huge green economy, Los Angeles need to build a world-class innovation hub. And that's what started the Los Angeles Clean Tech Incubator, which I was uh, fortunate enough to be the founder of and help build that in into a world-class uh, program and one that delivered over $620 million of long-term economic value to the city of LA. He made it happen through policies and through initiatives. And if you want to really uh, hear what Antonio thinks about how to do that, we did an interview with him a couple months ago. It's on my LinkedIn page. Uh, it's really a fascinating uh, interview of what a leader thinks and how do you make that change on top. Today's uh, mayor, Eric Garcetti, continues that tradition. Not only has he continued funding, of course, LACI. In fact, they've increased the funding of LACI. It's much bigger and much more robust today than it was before. But once again, he is walking the walk of innovation. I think he created the very first chief sustainability officer position within any of the major cities within the US. And Matt Peterson, the first chief sustainability officer, which by the way, Matt became the successor to me at LACI, has done a terrific job. Matt used an innovative idea. Why don't we get each city department to put together a plan on how they were gonna use sustainable technology to become more sustainable? Think about that. This is using each department to do to drive a market, to use purchasing power, to use planning to make the city more sustainable. I call that innovation at the very top. And I think that's where it starts. That's what it needs. It's real world stuff. OK. All right. This has been great. I uh, look forward to talking to you again. Please let me know what you think about all of this, because uh, I look forward to the dialogue. Uh, have a good one.